I think we're all good. So we should be able to actually do a thing now, which is nice. Return entry finished. Okay, now it's time for the Royal Rumble, folks. The real thing this time. Jesus Christ, Agent 47 is first into the ring for the real Royal Rumble. Are we really going to do this for real this time? The Intercontinental Champion, Agent 47, enters the ring. He took it from Will Smith. He took that belt from Will Smith, and I don't think Will Smith is going to be very happy about that. Jesus. All right. The 47 prepares himself for the battle ahead. Oh and his opponent, initially, is George Takei. I'm George You are a douchebag. George Takei, Mr. Sulu is in the ring. Fuck it, let's just skip that shit. Yeah, there we go. This will work now. Finally, the Royal Rumble begins. It's fucking half an hour overdue. That's fine. That's all right. George Takei and Age of 47 fight on. So every minute or so, a new entrant will come into the ring. And there's a lovely submission hold, but that doesn't count. There you go. There you go. Submissions don't count. I don't know what option I picked that was different, but hey, it has to be over the rope. Elimination. There we go. George Decay now tripping him up. Will the Intercontinental Champion manage to beat George Decay? Once we hit minute two, we'll be seeing our next entrance. Uh, it's not randomized uh, with the first eight, but after that it will be randomized, which is nice. Hey! And he takes it to the top rope. Boom! George Decay feeling that one. I think 47 has already expended a bit too much energy. Oh, a lovely low blow there to the top rope again. God, he's a high flyer. He loves being up there. Okay. See, Frankie Lynn, everything's working out just fine now. Entrant number three is Ronald McDonald. Entrant number three is Ronald McDonald. Of course, we already knew that. But in he gets with some stuff to do here. Do, do, do. Now, the entrance music will only play for the, uh, after we're done with the eight, uh, eight initial wrestlers. I think that's how that works. I don't know. Well, maybe they're just disabled by default. I don't know how that works. I, I'm fine either way, to be honest with you. Oh, shit. It's anyone's game here. Ronald McDonald doesn't even really want to fight right now, by the look of it. Oh, shit. 47 says, you know what? Fuck it. You're in this fight whether you like it or not. Now, this ring will fill up with eight people. And then after that, we'll we'll, uh, we'll start circulating people out of here. Oh my god. We got a tussle there, and 47 is down. Meanwhile, Takei and Ronald McDonald are finding each other. There's a lovely fireman drop right there. Good stuff, I love it. Oh, multiple hits to Takei, who is really feeling the, the pain right here. Oh! Ronald McDonald gets one in the eyes, and George Takei has been eliminated already! It's now down to Agent 47 and Ronald McDonald. It's anyone's game now. Anyone could can, can walk out of this one. I have no idea who will be victorious for the Royal Rumble today, but we will see how it goes. All right, Ron McDonald now choking the shit out of 847. Isn't that really his thing? But oh well. Um, why hasn't there been a new applicant? It's been five minutes. All right, every two minutes past the... Yeah, yeah, I get it. So we'll get another person entering the ring pretty soon. There's another choke out. That Ronald McDonald, he's a vicious motherfucker. There we go. Yeah. Ow. Oh, so many slaps. There's the Big Mac slap. I love it. What are you doing now? We're, oh, a lovely little flight, but there's no pinfalls here. Entrant number four is Wilford Brimley, who makes his way to the ring. And the ring will hopefully fill up pretty soon, I hope. All right, Wilford Brimley making his way to the arena. Yeah! Oh my god, 47 there. Ruined by Wilfred Brimley, who seems to be teaming up with Ronald McDonald, but no, Ronald McDonald should realize, should have realized by now that there are no friends in the Royal Rumble. So it's time to start fucking shit up. I think he's, I think he's got that now. Yep, yeah, alright, here we go. It continues on. Wilfred Brimley with the diabetes stomping right there. The Duke of Diabetes continues. Oh my god, and there we go, drag him to the centre, but Agent 47 with a nice straight punch there to his face. Take that Ronald McDonald, oh my god, Milford Brimley. He is fighting valiantly. Are we getting another entrance? I don't know. There we go, the Pepper Grime Bear enters at number five. 
and it seems like entrance themes just aren't happening. Don't know why. Wilfred Brimley now dragging Ronald McDonald through this area here. Serves him right as far as I'm concerned. We now have four people in the ring. The upper grind bear is in the ring. Now, now only George Takai has been eliminated. So that's one, two, three, four. Oh no! Age of 47 has been eliminated. There's only three in the ring. We need to get more people in. We can have a maximum of eight in here. And that's what I want to see at some point. Wilfred Brimley now with a lovely slam on that bear. Meanwhile, Ronald McDonald's still hanging in pretty tough. Those that enter later do have an advantage. Ronald McDonald now being double teamed by Wilford Brimley and the Pepper Grime Bear. I think we're getting another entrance soon, maybe? At the 10 minute mark, we'll see. There we go, Tommy Wiseau is entrant number six. In he comes. Oh, hi, everybody. <laughs> You're tearing me apart, everybody. I think I got that. Where's Hi Doggy? Hi Doggy. Hi Doggy. Hi Doggy. Oh, hi Mark. <laughs> oh my god. Oh, 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 Wilford Brimley was thrown out of the ring, but not over the top rope. So he's still in this match. It's not over yet. It is not over yet. This match continues on. With Ronald McDonald slapping the shit out of Wilford Brimley. Oh, love that double team. That bear's fucked up. Okay. Let's see how much longer this can take. Of course, there are no disqualifications here. There are no submissions, no countouts. Victory must be achieved by throwing your opponent over that top rope. Otherwise, nothing is going to happen. All right. Oh, bash in the back of Ronald McDonald's head. He deserved that. That fucker. All right. And entrant number seven is Mel Gibson. In he goes, and I don't know if we get any uh, theme songs now. It doesn't look like we do. How many entrants have we had so far? We've had two eliminations, so that's two, four, five, six, seven. We have one more entrant before it starts being completely randomized now. Mel Gibson's down. Oh, oh, Pepper Grime Band nearly thrown out of the ring by Wilford Brimley. Jesus Christ. Into the corner he goes. Oh my God, the bear is wrapped around that fucking post and he's being kicked in the fucking stomach by Wilford Brimley. And Ronald McDonald has been eliminated. Jesus Christ, we only have four people in the ring. Jesus Christ, we need some more people in Bronto. There we go. Oh, oh, that bear. That bear's getting angry. Oh, there we go. Mel Gibson going for the low blow there. Oh, shit. Wilford Brimley. Oh, nearly eliminated by Tommy Wiseau there, but not just yet. Not just yet. He's hanging in there. And there's the bear hug in response. Tommy Wiseau, speaking of bears, that bear is fucking up Mel Gibson. And nobody joins us for the Royal Rumble, which is still underway. We need another person to come into the ring. It's, it's, yep, we're nearly there. We're nearly there. Oh, the bear's off the ropes. Oh, that looks painful. Oh, that clock is ticking, that clock is ticking. No more entrance. There should be someone coming up soon. Maybe another minute has to go by. Tell me why so now. Well, throwing him. Well, Mel Gibson off the ropes. Also fucking up uh, Wilford Brimley's vision there. He is completely and utterly exhausted though. He's probably ready to be thrown out of the ring. Oh, no, tell me why so he's not having it. Oh, punches, punches, punches. Oh, bye Mark, bye Wilford. And there we go, entrant number eight is Jonathan Archer. There we go, and that's all the official members coming in. And the bear's been eliminated. Out he goes, replaced by Jonathan Archer. We're never gonna get eight people in this ring, I swear. Jesus Christ, Jonathan Archer there. Oh, with like a, whatever the fuck that move was. He just puts him on his shoulders and then drops him on his knee. Very strange, but I like it. <laughs> it's avant-garde. All right, but we've only got four combatants in this ring. Graham Kerr enters the ring, and we don't have any opening themes for anyone coming in anymore, which is sad. I don't know what's wrong there. Jonathan Archer out of the ring, but he's not over the top rope, so he'll be fine. Oh, my God. Maybe I've got entrance themes turned off. Oh, my God. Oh, my God. Tommy Wiseau has been eliminated by Graham Kerr. Oh, my goodness. I know, opening things don't work for the Royal Rumble anymore, which is a bit sad. I don't know what the fuck's wrong with it. 
Hurdy Gurdy enters the ring at number 10. Jesus Christ. Jesus Christ, he's in. Let's see how this goes. I mean, that's really fun when the entrance theme plays for a few seconds when people walk in. The Eldritch being turned Abigail into a witch. Oh no. You mustn't do that to little Lolly. Right, oh, there's a kick. I love it. I love it. Oh, this <laughs> is appealing to the crowd. Cher is entrant number 11. And we got a witch wife over there. Oh my goodness gracious me. But the match continues. Cher has now entered the ring. Anything could happen when Cher's there, I can tell you. I don't know why the opening themes aren't playing. Hurdy Gurdy is alive again? I guess so. Well, he was a random entrance, so he's not a zombie anymore. <laughs> I wish, I wish he entered as a zombie. I oh, and Wolf of Brimley is eliminated, only to re be replaced by OJ Simpson at entrant number 12. Jesus Christ. So how many have got in the ring now? Four, five, six, I don't know. Graham Kerr now taking on Cher as OJ Simpson watches on in amazement. And now he's taking on Graham Kerr. The ring's already getting pretty bloody. Oh, Graham Kerr now punching the shit out of OJ Simpson. Okay. Oh. <gasps> Billy Mays is entrant number 13. It's still anyone's game. I don't know who's going to win this one. It's all randomized now. Oh my god. So there's four. One, two, three. Okay, so one more entrant and we'll have a full complement in the ring. Of course, at that point, we'll, we'll hope someone gets thrown out at some point. Jesus Christ, there's OJ dealing with Cher the only way he knows how. Getting another entrant in? The other one? We are! Entrant number 14 is Dwayne! In comes Dwayne! <laughs> I guess Hurdy must have asked Jesus to be resurrected before the match or something. Oh my god, Cher's just going to town on everyone. Look at that, Jesus Christ. Oh, Graham Kerr's nuts are fucked there. That's how you open up a coconut. But she is absolutely fucking exhausted at this point, and so am I. OJ Simpson now fucking up both Cher and Dwayne. He's not having it. Alright, we got a full compliment in this ring. It's eliminations only now. Oh, Dwayne's dancing victory there. Well, a little bit premature though, I think. OJ Simpson absolutely destroying Graham Kerr. Meanwhile, Billy Mays is taking on Archer. Oh my god, Mel Gibson, I believe, has been eliminated. Yes, he has. We need another entrance in a minute. Oh my god. <laughs> OJ Simpson is forking the shit out of Graham Kerr. Meanwhile, Billy Mays is getting getting uh, Archer in a, in a weird lock there. Very strange submission hold. He is number one, but Dwayne right behind him. A cheap shot on Billy Mays. Oh, as, as the, oh my god, the action continues. We'll have a new entrant in another 10 seconds. Oh, four, three, two, one, boom. Okay, I guess not. Someone else will pop up soon, I'm sure. God, so much blood in this ring. It is insane. OJ Simpson thrown into the ropes and Jonathan Archer there with a nice tackle there. And I thought that was the Juice's uh, skill set. Oh, the charges were his. There we go. There's a charge. Looks like he charged him right back. Oh, Graham Kerr now with the fork on Cher as Billy Mays takes on Herney. And Jonathan Archer has been eliminated. Alex Jones just entered the ring. Oh my god. Alex Jones is now in the ring now. Oh my god. Was someone eliminated? I don't know. I didn't see. I think it's just multiple groin shots. Oh god, there's so much blood. So much blood. So many groin shots. This is insane. This is absolutely in fucking insane. Dwayne there with a the bulldog on Billy Mays. Meanwhile, Graham Kerr fucking up Alex Jones. Everyone's fucking up Alex Jones. Oh, there was a... There was a, an OJ charge there, which didn't quite work on Alex Jones, but that's alright. It's all good. Alex Jones now going off to share. Off the ropes. Hey, down she goes. Getting rid of Cher might be a pretty uh, tactically sound decision, I think. Meanwhile, Graham Kerr stomping the shit out of OJ's balls. I think he's due for it, honestly. 
And Graham Kerr has been thrown out by Billy Mays. Ron Jeremy is entrant number 16. It's still anyone's game. I don't know who's going to win this one. I'm hoping for a Ron Jeremy victory. But he is uh, entering entering this pretty, pretty early on, so I don't know. Jesus Christ, it's going all over the place. Oh, a test of strength there, and it looks like... It looks like Alex Jones lost to Ron Jeremy. And Hurdy Gurdy's going absolutely insane with OJ right now. He's just throwing Dwayne into the into the ropes there. He throws OJ into the ropes. It's going all over the place. Hurdy now punching shit out of the juice. Let's see. Oh, Billy Mace now getting some punches there from Dwayne. And, oh, oh, that's not an elimination. Cher's still in this. She's still in this. She's just a bit dazed, but back in she goes. Oh, my God. This is just insane. It's just never ending. Oh, my God. Alex Jones is still in this, and 30 minutes have already gone by. Now we have to see who's going to get eliminated from this match. This could go on forever. Hurdy, meanwhile, choking the shit out of OJ Simpson. Do we have an elimination? I don't know. I don't think so. I think it was a groinal shot. Oh, 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 ah, there goes Cher tackling the shit out of the shoulder charging. Oh, Dwayne, but Dwayne's taking care of him. And oh my god, there's a flight there. Bob Ross. Oh, now you start playing some music. Bob Ross. Bob Ross. Fake news, Bob Ross. Enters the ring. And finally, we're getting some, some entrance music. I don't know why all the other ones wouldn't play. But Deadpool is in. With his serene music there. He's not the real Bob Ross, but you know what? He's the only one here right now. What is he doing? What is he doing to, to Alex Jones? He's just kind of flailing about. That is the weirdest thing I've ever seen. Meanwhile, Billy Mays being fucked around a bit. Bob Ross pool in, indeed. God, what a bloody ring. Oh, Hurdy Gurdy's been eliminated by Cher. Oh my God. It's still anyone's game. Ron, Ron Jeremy off the ropes there. And again, trying to take on Deadpool here. Oh, another groinal shot. So many groinal shots. Oh, so many groinal shots. OJ likes going for that groin, what can I say? Meanwhile, oh my god, Alex Jones fucking up Bob Ross pool all day. Looking pretty good, I have to say. This Royal Rumble is looking pretty crazy right now. We've got, oh, a battle here between, oh my god, Alex Jones has knocked the shit out of Ron Jeremy. I hope he does well here, I hope he does. Good god almighty, this could go on for a while. Meanwhile, Ron Jeremy with a headbutt there on the juice. OJ is down. And there's another groinal shot there. Now, oh, here we go. Oh, that's okay. Cher, here we go. Cher being taken to the top rope here. Oh my god, she slaps him, but it's not enough. Down she goes. Meanwhile, yeah, I mean, I'm loving the Ron Jeremy action here. Dwayne now taking advantage of the situation. Alex Jones trying to get Cher into a headlock, but just not working. God, there's so much blood. Okay, oh, oh, and here's Jimmy Jordan as entrant number 18. Oh, it's looking good. It's looking good here. Jimmy Jordan knows what he's doing. Jimmy Jordan here. Ready to go all coked up on these guys. Gets the top slot slam here. I hope Jimmy Jordan wins this, although it's unlikely given the circumstances. All right. Oh, OJ Simpson now fucking up. Ron Jeremy with multiple headbutts. I mean, you, you just you just can't say more than that, really, can you? All right, and down goes Cher. No one's been eliminated in a while now. OJ wondering what the fuck is going on and taking to the top rope with an elbow drop. Meanwhile, Dwayne is trying to take on... Oh, there we go. Trying to take on Bob Ross Deadpool there. Oh, Christ almighty. I can't keep track of all this. This is insane. Oh... So many fights going on here, little miniature fights, and oh, Billy Mays nearly thrown out of the ring there by Dwayne. Nearly thrown out, oh, nearly again. Oh, and Dwayne was thrown out by Jim. I think, I think he's eliminated. No, he wasn't over the top rope, okay. Shit. Deadpool there with a kick to the face there for Alex Jones. And meanwhile, OJ's off the rope there, and there goes Cher in the face. This is insane, it's going everywhere. 
No one's being eliminated though, so this could last forever. This could go on all fucking night. Hopefully the game doesn't crash again. If it does, I guess we'll just give up on it. Oh, oh here we go. Oh, Jimmy the Scott Jordan off the ropes and right into Cher. So many encounters going on right now, it's crazy. Share oh. now, I mean, I mean really. There was blood outside the ring, I know. Someone landed outside the ring with a bleeding face. Oh my god. Alex Jones now getting really pissed off. No one's being eliminated here. Oh, there's a groin hit right there. Someone has to get eliminated soon. Share now, still. Still with that mad laughter and dance of hers. Jesus Christ. Let's go. Jimmy's off the ropes. Everyone's still in the ring so far. No one's getting eliminated. Oh, Deadpool's pulled out a chair. That there is an illegal move. Can't do that. Uh oh. Uh oh. Oh, no, not just yet. Thought Ron Jeremy was about to be eliminated by Alex Jones there, but no, not quite the case. This is still anyone's game here. OJ Simpson now in a in a lock there, but there are no submissions here in the Royal Rumble at all. Jesus Christ. It just won't stop, it's just never ending. Oh, oh, Dwayne there with his finisher. Oh, but he gets interrupted by Ron Jeremy. I feel bad for the guy who has to clean up the plant. The janitor. It's, oh my god, here we go. Dwayne is eliminated! Thrown out by Ron Jeremy. And that's it for Dwayne. Oh well, he did pretty well. Jimmy the Scott Jordan now with this weird, weird Deadpool fucking, fucking submission. I have no idea what the hell that is. Oh. Meanwhile, Billy May is ruining Cher here. We do need another contestant though. Any minute now, someone else is going to come into the ring to replace our fallen Dwayne. Jimmy almost eliminated though, but he's okay. He's still back in again. It's still anyone's match. Oh, the juice nearly thrown out. Jesus Christ, it's never ending. Uh oh, is that an, someone was thrown out? I don't know who. Cher was thrown out of the ring. It's over, finally. Cher, the she bitch has been destroyed. Oh, happy days. Oh, happy days indeed. We don't have any new contestants coming in though. That's a bit of a, a surprise there. We can't have gone through them all, surely. Oh, Ron Jeremy. Out of the ring, but not over the top rope. He's still in this. He's still in this, just barely. Oh, my God. Oh, Jimmy the Scott Gordon off the ropes. Off the ropes he goes. Surely another contestant is on the way soon. It's got to happen. Oh, there's a groin hit. There we go. Henry Swanson is in the ring. No music for him, though. Don't know how the fuck this works anymore. Oh, oh. Alex Jones has eliminated! But here comes Henry Swanson, the fucking powerhouse of men. He is going to destroy everyone in this ring. Oh my god. Is that- no, that's not it for Bob Ross. Deadpool Bob Ross is still in this, he's just a bit dazed. Oh my god. Who knows how- where this is going to go. So much blood. Oh my god, Jesus Christ! Jesus Christ is in the ring today! We may have blessed Hurdy, but now he's here to start taking names and kicking ass. OJ trying to throw Deadpool out of the ring, but it wasn't going to work. He's just, he's still a little bit too fresh, and that... Here we go. Oh my god. An engagement between Jimmy and Billy Mays. Both of them still going for each other now. There we go. Oh, oh, oh. Deadpool is out of the corner now. He's coming back. Oh, it's Jesus versus... Versus Henry Swanson and OJ is still in this match even though he's out of the ring. He's got to get back in though. There we go. Everyone's got to get back in. Jesus. Jesus now. Throws Deadpool out of the ring. Deadpool is gone. Oh my god. Jimmy. Jimmy the Scott Jordan has been eliminated as well. With uh, Ron Jeremy I think. Oh my god. Billy Mays is out. Jesus is fucking cleaning house. Jean-Claude Van Damme, still the reigning champion of PBS Champion Wrestling, makes his way to the ring. Holy ballsack. This is insane. It's going all over the place. I don't know who's going to win this one. It's anyone's guess at this point. Oh, out goes Jean-Claude already, but that's okay. Not over the top rope. There's one Jeremy. <laughs> Pelvic thrusts away. 
There's a submission hold. I mean, Jean-Claude loves that submission hold. What can I say? Oh my god, so much hitting around there. This is crazy. And Jesus being double teamed by the Juice and Jean-Claude. And oh my god, OJ Simpson has been eliminated. And that's it for him. Oh my god. We have four people in the ring now. Four Titans. I want to put Arnold in as well. Oh, I guess there's next year for that. Ugh. I'll see you next year, Jean-Claude Van Damme. You think you're the greatest? You're not. I am. Entrant number 22 is the President of the United States, Donald Trump. Not even in wrestling attire. He's just said, fuck it. Fuck it. I've been, I've beaten the shit out of Vince McMahon. I'm coming for you lot now. Oh my God. Here we go. Jesus is still in this. Oh my God. Ron Jeremy has been eliminated. Oh my God. Four people in the ring remain. It's not over yet. It is not over yet. We're still expecting someone else to enter the ring any moment now. George Costanza is entrant number 23. As he walks past the defeated Ron Jeremy. He did remarkably well though, I have to say. Ron Jeremy. Meanwhile, Trump is beating the shit out of the back of Jean-Claude Van Damme's head. And Henry Swanson's in a hole for, with Jesus. And now Trump and George Costanza taking on the champ. Well, Jesus and Henry Swanson are duking it out. I heard once Johnny Cage is based off Jean-Claude Van Damme. I mean, that makes sense. Entrant number 24 is Celine Dion, the Queen of Canada. In she goes. It's it's anyone's guess. Oh, I gotta love that planking attack that Trump has. I don't know what it is, but it's amazing. There it is, that planking attack he has. Yes, Celine Dion fucking up George. Feel the power of Jesus. Jesus' powers. Well, they, they didn't meet anyone at all. Good God almighty. This is a hell of a fight now. Kiru Kaza Kazuma. Entrant number 25 enters the ring. And he doesn't have unique music, but I expected his music to play there, but I guess it didn't. Only Deadpool's music has played so far. Oh, there goes Jesus. Trump was taking down Jesus. Meanwhile, Henry Swanson. Oh my God, that's the reversal. Donald Trump knows what he's doing in this fight here. Donald Trump versus Jesus and Henry Swanson. Meanwhile, Jean-Claude Van Damme trying to pick his opponent. As George, George Cassandra. Oh my God, Matt Dickey is in an entrance, num entrance number 26. Matt Dickey is here. The, uh, the wrestling imperial himself. Oh, there goes Celine Dion. Throw him to the mat right there. Matt Dickey is in the... In, in this match now, so it's anyone's guess what will happen next. I find it funny the first person Kiru went for was Trump. <laughs> no, just went for him. Jean-Claude Van Damme kneeing the shit out of Jesus' head. Kneeing the shit out of the crown of his head. Which makes sense. Jesus! Jesus has been eliminated by Jean-Claude Van Damme and he is the he is the champion, so that makes sense. Down goes Donald Trump. Oh, it's anyone's match at this point. I don't know who it is. Who's been in the in the ring the longest? Um, that would actually be Henry Swanson. He's a bit OP, so let's see how he goes. George Costanza sends him into the mat there. And speaking of mats, Matt Dickey now giving him a, a headlock. But Henry Swanson kicks the fuck out of that one. Oh my god. Oh, so many punches. Oh, it's still it's still going. It's still ongoing. George Costanza with a head, headlock there on the champ. Meanwhile, there's, there's this, oh my god, massive fight there. Oh, Henry Swanson being triple teamed there by Matt Dickey, Celine Dion, and Kiru. Oh my god, this is insane. Donald Trump now in an engagement now with Kiru, who's just kicking him in the, in the chest. Donald Trump wins that engagement, that's fine though. Oh my god. Oh, oh, no, oh. oh. Claude Van Damme tried to do something to Henry Swanson, but he's not having it. Oh, there goes George Costanza. George is getting upset. And Henry Swanson eliminated by Jean-Claude Van Damme. He is the champ after all. He's doing quite well. All right, so we do need a new person in the in the ring. Who's that going to be? It's Hillary Clinton, entrant number 27. Former first lady. Former, uh, former uh, opponent to Donald Trump. Oh my goodness. And she's going straight for him. Okay, there we go. Trump and Hillary now. Oh, she's just slapping the shit out of everybody. Jean-Claude Van Damme, they're saying, no, nope, not today, Hillary Clinton. 
And now, Celine Dion going after Trump, but Trump, oh my god, stretching her out a bit. Meanwhile, Matt Dickey watching on. I don't know whose side he's on, but there are no sides in the Royal Rumble. Anything goes here. Anything fucking goes. Celine Dion from the top rope takes down Trump. Good times. And Jean-Claude Van Damme nearly eliminated by, oh, Hillary Clinton. And Celine Dion still in this, this match as well because she was not thrown over that top rope. Oh, oh God, it's still anyone's match. I don't know who to back on this one. My money's on no one. And entrant number 28 is the original Bob Ross. The original and the best. Oh my God, Hillary Clinton actually cleaning house here. Oh, thrown into Jean-Claude Van Damme by the president. And oh, here comes Bob Ross doing some things here. Uh-oh, Celine Dion now being double teamed and down she goes. Oh, we have an elimination here. Jean-Claude Van Damme, the champ, has been removed from the Royal Rumble. Meanwhile, Trump is just ruining the shit out of Matt Dickey. Hillary Clinton now celebrating something. I don't know what she did. Oh my God, it's going all over the place. Bob Ross not taking no double teaming today. And here we have Kiru with some kicks there. Still hanging in there. Celine Dion though, very technical fighter. She is hanging in there. Things are looking good for her. Oh my God, there's Trump there thrown to the ground as he should be. George Costanza with the headlock there. Donald Trump struggling to get free. Meanwhile, Celine Dion also in a headlock now. Bob Ross is fucking her up. Hey, is that an, another elimination I didn't see? I thought I heard the bell ring. It might have just been a groinal injury though. Meanwhile, Trump and Matt Dickey going at it now. It's not elimination time just yet. There we go. Oh shit, there's so many half moves, half finished. Because people just keep running into other people or interrupting them. Tinky Winky, entrant number 29, the Teletubby is in. Now he can finally get some, some carnage going for real. Okay, oh god, Celine, don't leave the ring just yet, don't do that. Okay. Tinky Winky just jumping on Matt Dickey now, who is bleeding profusely. This ring is getting very, very bloody. Jesus Christ, everyone's just piling into the corner here. Bob Ross now, trying to do some stuff. Oh my god. Trump ruining the shit. Oh my god, Tinky Winky fucking the shit out of Hillary Clinton. That is a sight to see, only on PPS Champion Wrestling though, really. George Costanza is off the rope. Oh my god. And Hillary has been eliminated from the Royal Rumble. Off she goes. Oh, she just she just can't ever win, can she? All right, oh, 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 there we go. Tinky Winky's grabbed Celine Dion by the groin. That's a bit unsavory, but sure, there we go. Down she goes. Oh. Yeah, oh, she's shoving Tinky Winky down, though. Kira, oh my god, off the ropes. That did not work out too well, though. Celine just smashed her head on the corner post. That fucking Teletubby is creeping the shit out of me. Someone please eliminate it. I don't want to see it anymore. I don't like it. George Costanza is being grabbed by Tinky Winky. Bob Ross there, fucking up Celine Dion. I think he's about ready to finish her off, but oh, there we go. A confrontation between the two of them. Meanwhile, Tinky Winky throwing George Costanza out of the ring. He's not out though. He's not over the top rope. And there we go, Kiru there. Ready to headbutt the shit out of the president. Oh, George Costanza though, taking advantage of the situation. Jesus Christ, that Teletubby is fucking up Celine Dion. He's just fucking creepy. Uh, here we go. Oh, entrant number 30 is Michael Aspel. <laughs> From Antique Roadshow fame. Into the ring he goes. This is going to be very interesting. Oh my god. Matt Dickey's still bleeding, but he should be okay. He should be fine. He's still hanging in there. Oh, Bob Ross nearly thrown out by Kiru, though. Oh. They go, no, oh, he's going, he went for another one, but Bob Ross like, no, nope, fuck it, right for the groin. Meanwhile, Michael Aspel going after Matt Dickey, throwing him out of the ring, and that's him eliminated. All right, Jesus Christ. It's never ending here, people. It's never fucking ending here. Hey, that's a beautiful move there by Bob Ross. Doing stuff there, nearly thrown out of the ring there. Michael Aspel is just throwing people out left, right, and center. He's trying to end this as quickly as possible. 
I can understand why, too. Let's see, that, that fucking talent tubby is trying to ruin Donald Trump, and I guess Donald Trump's just not having it. Hey, so many drags to the center and attacks there. Jakey Wakey. Oh my god, there goes Celine Dion. She just she just can't quite hack it anymore. There we go. Oh shit! Michael Aspel's still in this match, as is Kiru, but oh my god, so many people almost falling out of the ring and falling out of the ring. Oh my god. Yeah. And there's oh, Teletubby getting fucked up there by Bob Ross and George Costanza. That's what I like to see. Okay. Oh, oh, Tinky Winky. Entry number one, Bob Barker enters the ring and he gets theme music. I don't know why he gets theme music. Fucking hell. Alright. I'm okay with this. And Bob Ross is down. Down there. Donald Trump just punched his head out of him. George Costanza is eliminated by Bob Barker, the new entrant. So many punches to her face. Right, uh oh, it's Donald Trump. Donald Trump is eliminated by Bob Barker. He is fucking taking names and kicking ass. Jesus Christ, Bob Barker. And Bob Ross is eliminated. Jesus Christ. I don't know by who, though. Uh, let me have a quick look. I can actually check these things. Uh, I can't actually see. I wish I could see. Oh, here we go. Uh, here we go. Bob Ross eliminated by Celine Dion. Okay, wasn't expecting that. Okay. Meanwhile, there are five people in this ring, I think. Three, three, four, five. Yep, all right. And it's still anyone's guess. Nobody has to go. But, oh, Kiru nearly eliminated by Bob Barker. Oh. That Teletubby is cheating. Celine Dion eliminated. Jesus. Bob Barker is just destroying everybody here. I think he was eliminated. She was eliminated by him. Fred Rogers enters the ring. Because why the fuck not? He hasn't he hasn't participated in this, so he might as well. Oh my god, multiple punches to the face. It's all good though. Tinky Winky spins Michael Aspel around and around. And around, and oh my god, another elimination. I can't see who it was, though. Could have been Bob Barker. I don't know who it was. I better check that. Is that Trump? Oh, Kiru was eliminated. M. Night Shyamalan is the next entrance. And the fighting continues. It's still going. It's still ongoing. Oh my god. Michael Aspel's still in. He fell out of the ring, but he's, he's, he'll, he'll be back in there. It's all good. Here we go. There are no redos and no accidents here. Test of strength shows that that <laughs> M. Night Shyamalan is weaker than Fred Rogers. And now they team up to fuck that Teletubby up. Entrant number 34 is Will Smith. Will Smith is in the ring now. Somebody please ruin that Teletubby, please. Fred Rogers with a jumping headbutt there. I love it every time. Alright, and Bob Barker now. There's the Teletubby. Completely ruined there. Please, throw him out of the ring. I don't want to see him anymore. He's unpleasant. Oh my god, he's unpleasant to look at. Oh, there's a low blow. Oh my god. I think. Was that Bob Barker? Tom Welling enters the ring. No, it was Michael Aspel. Michael Aspel has been eliminated. And Tom Welling enters the ring. The number one contender. God knows why he still bothers to continue on at this point just keeps losing I mean he won he won all of those matches to become uh, first contender for the championship match but still lost once again so oh my god Barry Gibb is entrant number 36 still lost to Jean-Claude Van Damme though who is still the champion the reigning champion but Barry Gibb is in now things get serious there's a lovely hip toss there that's what I like to see M. Night Shyamalan. Oh, it looks like Fred Rogers helping out Barry Gibb there. That fucking Teletubby. Get rid of it. Oh, God. So many groinal grabs. I can't stand it. Hey. Okay. Oh. There we go. Oh, can Barry Gibb take on uh, Tom Welling is the real question here. I don't know. It's the ultimate test of strength here. Oh, God. There's the double team there. Bob Barker still fucking... 
fight strong here. But not enough to take on Tom Welling. That fucking Teletubby. I'm sick of it. I want it to die. I want it gone. And Bob Barker's off the ropes. Doesn't do much though. Jared Fogel. Entrant number 37 is in the ring now. Jared Fogel, the, the, the five foot, uh, five dollar foot long guy himself. Just stop touching kids. Or maybe he'll be the one to destroy Tinky Winky once and for all. I hope so. Well, well, he's got Will Smith now in a lock. Not that that matters. And now Superman versus Bob Barker. Bob Barker wins. He is fucking things up. He fucked that Teletubby up. He fucked up Superman. No one can stop Bob Barker today by the look of it. Maybe he should have been the number one contender. Oh, there's the Smallville Super Buster though. I think that might be it for Bob Barker. Oh my god. And now Jared Fogel trying to sleep a hold of shit out of uh, Mr. Rogers, but he's not having it. He's not having it. Oh, we've got another elimination. Tinky Winky is finally defeated. I couldn't be more happy. Finally, Tinky Winky is ruined and destroyed. I do not want to see that fucker ever again. Phew. That was, that was immensely satisfying that Tinky Winky is now out of this match forever. He's been here way too long. And there's a jumping kick from the top rope there. Will Smith gets a jumping kick there from Fred Rogers. He's now taken to the top rope to deal with Tom Welling. Meanwhile, Jared Fogel is... Oh my god. M. Night Shyamalan eliminated Bob Barker. Unexpected. And Tom Welling is out of the ring, but he's not eliminated just yet. Oh god, Fred Rogers now ruining the shit out of, of Will Smith. From what I can see, and Jared Fogel there with this figure four leg lock on Barry Gibb. M. Night Shyamalan trying to, trying to help, but he's just not doing a very good job here. Oh, an elbow to the back of the neck. Oh my god, the small wheel super buster there on Fred Rogers. It's just, oh my god, how, he's just, he's done. He's done. Entrant number 38 is Tim Allen. Tim Allen is in this match, finally. Let's see how Tim the Toolman can fuck things up. There we go, there's a nice boring attack there. Beautiful stuff. This match just doesn't seem to want to end. Oh, there we go. The small Bill Super being thrown around a bit now by Fred Rogers. Oh god, he's fighting back. Barry Gibb there with a lovely elbow drop. Jared Fogel needs to be destroyed. It's entrant number 39, Lum time. Lum is in the house. Oh, Fred Rogers getting spun around and down he goes. And Lum is going to try to take out the Smallville Super. It's not working too well for her just now, though. Oh, no, you don't. Oh, and Will Smith has been thrown out of the ring. That's it for him. Jesus Christ, and there we go. The Smallville Super is in a leg lock there. Scorpion leg lock. Barry Gibbs still in this as well as Tim the Toolman. And Lum is already thrown out of the ring, but she's not been eliminated. Jesus Christ, she's got to step up her game. If she's going to win this one, she probably won't, but we'll see. She is still best girl. Oh my God, everyone's just being... Fred Rogers and Lum are just throwing each other around in that corner. Oh! M. Night Shyamalan, not eliminated just yet. Neither... Wait, someone was thrown out. Fred Rogers has been eliminated, I believe. Yes, but Tom Welling is still in. He's still got this. Dear God, it really is never-ending. There are so many wrestlers. And there goes M. Night Shyamalan, eliminated by Lum. Best girl wins again. Oh my God, there's an elbow to the back. There's an elbow to the back. Oh my God. It just won't end. This just won't end. Barry Gibb is in the corner now. He is fucking exhausted. Oh, there we go. A lovely choke slam there for the Smallville Super. It serves him right, I say. Jared Fogel now giving him a sleeper hold. Julia Charles, entrant number 40. I don't know how many we have left. I've lost count of how many characters we have at this point. Oh, oh and Barry Gibb gets right to work on Julia Child with, a, with those uh, knees to the stomach. But she's fighting back. Tom Welling now ruining the shit out of Jared Vogel while Lum is being beaten up by Tim uh, Tim Allen a bit. Tim the Tool Man is doing the best he can to survive, but oh my god. Entrant number 41 is Oprah, who gets her entrance theme as well. Oh my god, someone was eliminated. I don't know who it was. It wasn't Barry Gibb. It was Jared Vogel. There you go. Go touch kids somewhere else, Jared. 
Nobody wants you or your Subway sandwiches. All right, Julia Child's out, and then she's in again. Always, always out and in again. It's insane. Okay, oh, Lum with the kick there to Oprah, and there's an elbow drop. Phil Swift is in the ring as entrant number 42. I think I know what the problem is. All of the characters who we've not heard um, theme music from today, they all work. But all the ones we have heard today are just not kicking off, and I don't know why. We'll have to look into that. Oh my god. And Tom Welling nearly eliminated by Julia Child. Phil Swift, though. Definitely put him through his paces. Oh, there we go. Say that. There we go. Mum's got a bit of a headache. She'll be all right, though. She'll be all right. Barry Gibbs is still in this. Oh, I think he's the. Uh, I think he's been in the longest so far. There goes Oprah Winfrey into the mat there, and a lovely choke slam for Tim the Tool Man. As, oh no, wait. Tom Welling has been in the longest. Someone's got to eliminate the shit out of him. He's he's going to cause problems. Oh, Julia Child now, punching the shit out of Lum. It's <laughs> Phil Swift finishing the job. Tom Paris is entrant number 43. But Tim the Toolman has been eliminated, so someone has to replace him. Oh god, it's never ending. A 90 minute fucking match. It's still going. It's still anyone's fight here. Oh my god. So many eliminations. And there we go. Tom Welling has been eliminated by Tom Paris. Tom versus Tom, and Paris has won the Tom battle. Oh my goodness gracious me. So Julia Child taking on Oprah Winfrey. Meanwhile, Phil Swift ruining Barry Gibb and Tom Paris getting slapped around by Lum as you do. Oh, Lum is not taking no double teaming today. Oh my god, Phil Swift though. Oh, he's gonna throw Lum out, but Lum is still too good. She's, she's still in this. Oh, and a kick to the groin, that's what I like to see. And an elbow to the back, it just, it's just a back and forth here. Phil Swift takes it to the top rope with a dive there. He's, he's heavy enough that the gravity alone is going to be doing a lot of damage. That's a lot of damage. Okay, oh, still goes on there. Barry Gibb is completely out of breath at this point. But he's still hanging in there. He's still hanging in there. Oh, yep, just keep kneeing people. If he's going to have any hope of winning this, he needs to sort of get back a bit. Oh my god, Phil Swift doing some things. Oh, and a kick to the groin again. Lum, Lum's going for them balls. Tuvok enters the ringers, entrant number 44. I don't know how many we have left now. It can't be that many, surely. Tuvok is in, and he's going straight for Julia Child. Oh! And he's not taking no shit from Tom Paris. Oh my god, we've got an elimination. I, yep, Barry Gibb is out. Eliminated by Lama, I think. Not 100% sure on that. Uh, no, Oprah Winfrey. Okay, never mind. LeVar Burton enters at number 45. Oh my god. Alright, oh, Lum. Lum has been eliminated. Oh my god, Julia Child and Oprah Winfrey taking on Tom Paris. Oh my god. There's Julia Child thrown out, but through the middle rope, so she'll be alright. She's back in. Meanwhile, this battle does continue. Only six people in the ring. We need a couple more. Unless that's it. Unless we've dried up the well of contestants. Once that's happened, then that's it. Then that's all we have left. It's on Paris now. Oh! Sweet tripping up Oprah Winfrey there. Julia Child now also taking on Tom Paris. Tom is just throwing Oprah out. Now it's just Oprah and Tom Paris just on their own here in the corner. Meanwhile, Tuvok, uh, oh god, is being completely destroyed there by LeVar Burton. Phil Swift also getting whacked there, but Julia Child waiting there. Oh my god, it's Jean-Luc Picard. Picard is in. Here we go, it's time to go. Walk Picard time. Oh, Oprah Winfrey eliminated. There you go, Oprah Winfrey is out of this match as well. God, we're going to hit the 100 mark, aren't we? Jesus Christ. Meanwhile, oh, Phil Swift getting jump kicked in the back. And that flip there, you got to admit, Picard knows what he's doing. Tom Paris not taking that shit, though. Vince Offer is in now. Vince Offer. I, of course, I forgot about him. Is he going to take on Phil Swift? 
I don't know, only time will tell. He takes it to the top rope already, and that was a very unwise move on his part. He's taking on Tom Paris, who was kneeing the shit out of him. And Tom Paris now taking on Tuvok. I mean, Tom is, he's, he's a brawler, he's hanging in there. And down goes Julia Child in one punch. LeVar Burton now with a pile driver on Phil Swift. And it's still anyone's game at this point. I don't know who it's going to be from here on out. It could be anyone. It could literally be anyone. I don't know who it's going to be, but it's going to be someone. Oh, Picard off the ropes. And he's fine though. LeVar Burton now. Yeah, there we go. Take that, Picard. Oh my god, Vince off was thrown out, but he's still in. He is still in this. Oh, oh, Julia Charles has been eliminated by LeVar Burton. And in goes the fucking dilly-eyed fuck himself, Chad Kroger. Chad Kroger is in. Must be running out of contestants now, surely. Oh, look at that jumping flip there from Picard. That Picard maneuver is epic to be sure. Oh my goodness, it still goes on though. The battle goes on. I don't know. Oh, here we go. Phil Swift has been eliminated by LeVar Burton. He knows what he's doing. He knows what he's doing. Vince Offer is just playing it safe and keeping his distance. Chad Kroger, though, also pretty fresh. And we got another elimination. Tuvok has been thrown out already. Oh, my God. I feel like he hasn't been in for very long. All right. Oh, LeVar Burton now. Taking Chad Kroger with some knees to the face. Don't know what's next from here on out. Oh, my God. Here we go. Chad Kroger now. Oh, and there's a nice little eye, eye gouge right there. Good times. It's still not over yet, though. Um, oh, and the timer has ended. I guess this is it. I, I guess this might be it. This might this might be our last five. The timer has officially stopped. I don't know it's because it went too high or because we're just done. We're just done. We have no more opponents left. That's entirely possible. I can't think of anyone else that we haven't seen yet. LeVar Burton now sending Vince Offer into the canvas just like that. Alright, and there's the choke out there. No, there's Janeway. We're not done yet, even though the timer is gone. This match has been going on for so long, the timer's just fucked off. But we still have contestants here. Janeway is in. This place is filling up with Star Trek, man, I'm telling you. We have four Star Trek people in, four Trekkers. And two regular people. Tom Paris, though, eliminated by his captain. Meanwhile, Chad Kroger and Vince Offer going at it now. And now he's switching over to, to uh, LeVar Burton. Okay. Phil Knight, the science prick, is in. All right. The pseudo-science guy is in the ring now. Let's see how this goes. I don't like... I don't like where this is going for anyone involved. The captains are going at it now. Picard and Janeway... Completely ruining each other now. Meanwhile, Bill Nye in a test of strength with LeVar Burton. LeVar Burton is losing bad. Meanwhile, Chad Kroger fucked up <laughs> with a torture whack there from Vince Offer. Elvis Dumbledore, of course, is walking into the ring as well. And this match has been going on for nearly an hour now. It's just, it's been, it's been going on overtime now. Who knows who's going to win it? I have no idea myself. Elvis Dumbledore, yeah, not taking no shit from Chad Kroger with a nice falling drop there. And now, knees to the back of the head, but Vince Offer saying nope. And Dumbledore's like, no, I'm, I want to punch Chad Kroger. Don't interrupt me. I want to fuck up Chad Kroger today. And so he is. And he did just that. All right. What else we got here? Oh, yeah, there we go. Into the corner there with Dumbledore. Oh my god, it's magic versus science here today as Bill Nye kicks the testicles out of Dumbledore. Maybe he's got a spell for that one. I don't know. And we've got a tussle here between LeVar Burton and Bill Nye, the science guy. Two, two uh, uh, people of knowledge on PBS here. Oh my god. Oh, oh. Yeah, there we go. Dumbledore trying to do something there to Picard. He's trying. He's trying. God, the match continues. Vince Offer trying to fend off two enemies at once here. Or maybe it's LeVar who's trying to fend off both Chad Kroger and Vince Offer. Meanwhile, Picard and Janeway tussling with Bill Nye the Science Guy and Dumbledore. I mean, it's just, it's never ending. It just keeps going. It just keeps going. I haven't seen an entrant in a while, so we might be at the end of this. We might be at the end of this. I don't think there's any more left after this. 
There goes Dumbledore MC in a hold there. Very strange hold there with the card. But if it works, it works. Meanwhile, Vince Offer of trying to pull the head off of LeVar Burton. Not today, says LeVar. The reading rainbow continues on and into the corner he goes for some reason. Just decided to make a sprint for the corner there. Vince Offer of now. Oh. Hey, that's a lovely move right there. LeVar's got a really good move set. I like his stuff. All right. Better it keeps going though, there goes Janeway doing something there. I don't know what that was, it was kind of obscured there. Jesus Christ. It looks like we're seeing the end of the- Oh my god, Vince Offer has been eliminated. I think we're running out of contestants here. We've only got so many contestants. And Chad Kroger has been eliminated by Dumbledore as well. And with that, we only have five more contestants. The, the end is drawing near. Whoever wins the Royal Rumble, I don't know who it will be, but it will be one of these people. There we go, Janeway now being thrown around like a rag doll. Meanwhile, Dumbledore's still fucking around. I think Dumbledore is the freshest entry here. The final entrance, so if he plays his cool, he could win this one. Okay, oh, LeVar Burton nearly eliminated, but no, he's not having it. There's oh, another strange submission hold there, but submission holds do not count here. There we go, LeVar Burton now trying to put some pressure here on Dumbledore. Because he is perhaps the biggest threat here in the in the Royal Rumble. Uh, yeah, everyone's sort of going for Dumbledore, which is a, a wise decision as far as I'm concerned. Ooh. Oh, oh he, he's got Bill Nye in the thralls of magic. Looks like his science wasn't strong enough for it. Meanwhile, LeVar has got himself in an ankle lock there. Janeway is just wrecking the fuck out of his foot. He's kicked out in time, though. He's kicked out. And LeVar Burton with a lovely drop there. The literacy lift. And Dumbledore's in the corner, but he's coming back. He's coming back. He's not done just yet. Oh, a lovely drop kick there. Or a, or a foot drop, I suppose. Whatever the hell you call that. I think that's a leg drop. There we go. Leg drop up there. The corner there. Oh, my God. What's happening now? What's happening now? Oh, he's got him in a, heck, a neck lock. I don't know who's going to win this one. But it seems like we are at the end of all things here. We are at the end of all things. Dumbledore punching the shit out of Bill Nye. Meanwhile, Janeway and Captain McCard going after LaForge. Oh my god. Geordie LaForge fighting off. Oh, and Picard has been eliminated. And then there were four. LeVar Burton now with a oh lovely torture rack drop there on Janeway. Meanwhile, Bill Nye takes on the magic of Dumbledore. Science versus magic there. Oh, there we go. The ultimate fight of the century. And Janeway. Janeway's been eliminated. There are three left now. Who will come out on top? There's the trip there for Dumbledore. Have a nice trip, buddy. So being killed by Snape is not enough to finish the fucker off. He's still hanging in there. My money's on Dumbledore here. He's a fucking maniac and he's been in here the least amount of time. Everyone else is getting kind of tired. LeVar Burton, he's been in the longest at this point, and he's still fighting back. Ooh, there's some head punches there. Bill Nye, the science guy, getting rid of Dumbledore, probably the best idea. Throwing him away to deal more damage to LeVar Burton. Don't know what Dumbledore's thinking here. Oh! That is not over the top rope, though. Bill Nye is still in this. Whoa, what is going on? Hey, what about that reading rainbow? Jesus Christ. That is a magical fucking attack there by Dumbledore. He's just all over the place. It's like fucking basketball or something. Alright, well, he's got him in a headlock again. Bill Nye got Dumbledore in a headlock. Looks like they're the ultimate uh, enemies here. I mean, well, it really is. The two educators versus magic. Just fucking magic. Can Dumbledore beat science and literacy? Only time will sell. And of course, if he has eliminated, it is the ultimate battle between science and literacy, and we'll see how that goes. I'm kind of hoping for LeVar, LeVar Burton or Dumbledore. Either of those two would be great. Oh, Bill Nye already almost thrown out. I would like to see him removed. I want literacy versus magic here. Bill Nye, the chop to the neck guy. Oh, 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 he's trying to choke out LeVar Burton, though. You gotta get up, Dumbledore. And there's some magic there. This magic's too strong for the science. God, they're all so exhausted. Here we go. Oh, oh, oh. I don't know how this is going to go, but all three of them now. 
definitely duking it out as hard as they can. Are we going to see an elimination? Oh, down goes LeVar Burton. Here we go. Oh, there's the double team now. And there goes Dumbledore down into the floor. Jesus Christ, it's anyone's game here. I mean, they're all getting kind of tired. Oh, there's the magic. The magic has hit LeVar Burton and down he goes. Oh, Dumbledore is trying to regain his composure, though. He needs to gain his strength back again. Oh, so many punches to LeVar Burton's face. Take that, reading rainbow, I guess. Oh, oh LeVar Burton, so many punches. All right, it's all good, though. Oh, what is this? Lovely pile driver. I like it. I like what Dumbledore is doing with his uh, repertoire here. By no means is this match going to end by look of it. Oh, there's a roll up there, but you can't pin here. It's over the rope only, I'm afraid. Do, 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 do. Oh, oh, down goes Dumbledore. Oh, it's not over yet, though. Oh, on the top rope, LeVar Burton there, where the flying leg drop there. On, oh, Dumbledore, Dumbledore's down! Oh my god, and oh, LeVar Burton almost eliminated as well. All right, we're down to two here. It's literacy versus science. Can LeVar Burton do this? Oh, there's a flying leg drop from the top rope there. If LeVar Burton can take this, this will be a pretty decent win. Oh, but there's a groinal attack there by Bill Nye. We're very unhappy if Bill Nye wins this match. Come on, LeVar Burton. Oh, another one. Another punch to the dick. Oh, oh, just throws him down. And there's another submission hold, but there's no submission holds here. Jesus Christ, that ring is so bloody. Oh, here we go. Oh, throwing him into the ropes. Oh, that's just a simple punch and down he goes. Bill Nye, I think he came in a bit after LeVar Burton, so... LeVar Burton's at a, at a disadvantage here, but I'm still I'm still rooting for him. Oh, there's the taunt. He's going to the top rope and, hey, another leg drop. Oh, he's going for another one. Oh. At Zidigan? I don't know who Zidigan is, but... Yes, indeed. <laughs> Hello there, Liza Beth. He joined us at the very end of the of the Royal Rumble. It's It's been 50 plus wrestlers going through this, but we've finally got it to LeVar Burton and Bill Nye the Science Guy, and I don't know who's going to win this one. Submissions do not count. You've got to throw that bugger over the top rope in order for this to win. In order for this to end. Oh, oh, LeVar Burton's been eliminated. Bill Nye the Science Guy. Oh no, sad face. So that's two heel wins in a row for for two years. Two years in a row, two heels winning the Royal Rumble. Because last year it was fucking George Decay. But there you go. Match evaluation, 94%. Bill Nye can absolutely fucking destroys everyone. Oh my goodness. He lasted quite a while, but there you go. We have our winner of the Royal Rumble, Bill Nye the Science Guy. <laughs> Oh, uh, kick Nye, kick Nye! Oh my God! Unfortunately, he made he made it through, and that's just sad face. But there you have it. That was a thing. Holy shit! We did PBS Champion Wrestling. It's all done and dusted. Oh my God! Oh my goodness gracious me!